I'm Claire Suddeth with Time Magazine, and this is what's on Pop Chart this week. A French academic has published a new book all about the Smurfs and their love of communism. Antoine Bueno's The Little Blue Book is a critical and political analysis of Smurf culture, and he calls them horrible Stalinists, racists, and anti-Semites. Broadway has plans to turn yet another popular movie into a musical with the theatrical adaptation of Sylvester Stallone's Rocky. That leaves us with only one question. What rhymes with Adrian? In this week's creepy auction news, collectors have paid a combined $190,000 for Unabomber Ted Kaczynski's journals, hooded sweatshirt, sunglasses, and other property. At least the money goes to the victim's families, I guess? Martin has out Coldplay himself. Britain's most emotionally sensitive rock band has released a new single called Every Teardrop is a Waterfall. This sounds more overwrought than the poetry I wrote in high school. On June 8th, Manhattan's High Line, which is an elevated public park that is built on top of what used to be old railway tracks, opened a new section doubling the length of the park all the way to West 30th Street. The new portion includes several public art installations and a sound exhibit called Digital Empathy which delivers messages at restrooms, elevators, and water fountains. What a perfect start to the summer. That's all we've got for you on Pop Chart this week. I will just leave you with this weird Norwegian video.